we're here at the Edmonton Waste Management Center where all of Edmonton's waste comes for processing. We're going to take a look at a new process we've got where we're going to convert household waste into methanol and ethanol. Right now we're on the tipping floor of the integrated processing and transfer facility. Garbage trucks drop their loads onto the concrete floor here. Once the garbage is tipped on the tipping floor, it's conveyed into this room where uh, through a series of manual and automated sorting processes, we separate the compostable material from the non-compostable. Well, the non-compostable material is conveyed into this room. This is where we create something called refuse-derived fuel. We take material like soiled plastic or soiled paper, some wood chips, residuals from our recycling process, bits of uh, fabric like old t-shirts or carpet, that kind of thing. And we will chop all that material up and turn it into a kind of garbage fluff called refuse-derived fuel. And finally, here at the Edmonton Waste to Biofuels and Chemicals facility, we will convert the refuse-derived fuel first into a synthetic gas by taking that material and putting it into a chamber where there's very little oxygen and very high temperatures. That breaks down the molecular structure of the carbon-based waste. Then we take that material, that synthetic gas, and we will convert it in the rest of the process into methanol and finally later on into ethanol. We will convert 100,000 tons of Edmonton's waste into 38 million liters of ethanol every year.